We got Mickey Unwrapped, RC. That's right. And you know, I'm going to go ahead and say this. I don't think there's another podcast on the interwebs more suitable to talk about this album than going on. <laughs> I think this is made for us, honestly. Yes, indeed. Custom made. From- they made this shit in the 90s. They had the foresight. They knew <laughs> for- that this podcast would one day be a thing. They saw the TMNT album or whatever the hell that was that we reviewed that one time, and they were like, mm-mm. Yep. You, you, we gotta get on did, this. We, cu- uh, Ninja Turtles coming out of our shells. Barbie right. Think Pink. The Simpsons album. Oh, yes, uh, indeed. Simpsons Sing the Blues. Oh, my God, this album cover. <laughs> the Mouse with, of the Hour. the sagging Do you love pants. It? The sagging pants. The but sagging the draws, hat. The draws are his original red pants. <laughs> He's oh got God, the backwards God, hat. No. He's got the sunglasses Anything on. With that. <laughs> this, uh, oh, boy. Oh, my goodness. This is something, RC. Oh, give him some headphones. I'm looking headphones. at it right give now. Give Not the sagging pants. <laughs> Fucking 1994. This is... Okay, look. We just gotta get into this. Um, Hot off of the... What did you think? (laughs) Hot off of the changeover from, like, hip-hop going, yeah, we're not doing that Ice Ice Baby MC Hammer stuff anymore. (laughs) They're like, oh no, hold on. (laughs) Mickey's over here, like, the fucking feel-good party rap stuff. That's not over till Mickey Mouse says it's over. (laughs) It's that fucking meme. The uh, did uh, like didn't you forget to ask someone? <laughs> fucking m- the mouse has last say. Oh my so goodness! So what what did you think this was gonna be going in? I I, I don't know. <laughs> I had no idea. But when it was just a bunch of like parodies of, of <laughs> fucking rap songs, I was like, you know what? All right, that's about right. <laughs> but the- like I was um. I was expecting them to all be parodies. There are not nearly as many parodies no. as I thought they were going and to be. And the first one, like, does this weird splitting the difference of, I, I think they maybe tried to get the rights but couldn't for Ice Ice Baby, so it doesn't even slightly sound like It's very strange. Like it. Yeah. <laughs> the, the song is called Ice Ice Mickey, but the song doesn't at all sound like Ice Ice Baby. Like, none of it follows the formula. It doesn't resemble it at all, yeah. which is wild. Now, now but, but instead... Mm. No, go ahead. Well, I was just going to say, and the verses absolutely suck, but the parts that are at least interesting... (laughs) This is the worst song on the album. Yeah, but the parts that are at least interesting are Mickey, who does not rap in this song for some reason, but just doing the inserts around the verse of the song that's about him. Oh, God. And, oh, my God, it's so stupid that it almost wraps him back around to being kind of funny. He's like, "Uh, get down, (laughs) now get back up, (laughs) I'm, oh my god, the way he says it, he almost sounds like he's like looking at the camera. I'm busting a rhyme. <laughs> I sure hope I can get it fixed. <laughs> it's like, oh my god. <laughs> I, I have a couple other ones here. Uh, I have, uh, <laughs> do the right thing. Now do the left no. thing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, my favorite one, where he says, my homies. Uh, I mean, uh, homies. My homies. <laughs> <laughs> <My homies. laughs> why, why did he have to say that? Um, and then oh he says, God. I'm a hip hip hopper. Or is it a hip hop hipper? Oh my God. What is that? Well, Disney ain't nothing to fuck with legally, huh? <laughs> <laughs> we, are, we are notoriously litigious. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and then he has one line at the end where he says, I'm chasing the jam because the jelly got away. I'm like, what? Chasing the jam? Is that a phrase? Did they say that? Like, what? <laughs> You know, that was probably the closest one to a clever line. But I don't know what that means. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> so it's not. <laughs> Sorry, it doesn't count. And then, uh, you know, so I was thinking, like, all right, you know what? For a rap album by Disney, they at least, like, are treading lightly, you know? Okay, do the Vanilla Ice parody. No, no one's going to get angry about that. He's already a joke, you know? Oh, th- this one's fine. You know what I mean? Like... Uh, yeah, I think we can get away with that. There was one part where the guy the, who actually is rapping the song, yeah. <laughs> um, this is the only quote I have from him, where he goes, 
Minnie is fly. I was like, wow. Yeah, you know, here's the thing. Minnie is fly. The guy who's rapping at least has an inter- uh, has a cool sounding voice. You know, he's like, Minnie is fly. Da, 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 da. Like, yeah. he's hitting the beats. It's when <laughs> the other, it was when Minnie Mouse, oddly enough, more than you would expect, comes in when she's like saying the rhymes that are a little sloppy, you know, and you're like, oh, all right. <laughs> but Yeah, I don't know the- why we needed that. Yeah, so much. And and I think the first line that he says was, a fine musician, fun and dance are the first requisition. <laughs> like, what? what? <laughs> just like, why just... When, when was... When did Mickey ever have a reputation of being a musician? Uh, I, I think it was at least a conductor. But he was a wizard there. He wasn't even a fucking... <laughs> He was um, just a wizard. A wizard's apprentice. I think at one point he was, you know, next to the conductor guy. And he was an understudy. He was an understudy, right? Uh, <laughs> I think you're getting him confused with Bugs Bunny. Oh, maybe. Uh, but, uh, what, maybe. Wait, yeah, I'm where's that sure. album? Oh, right. He only had one song on that fucking uh, Space Jam album. He, he, uh, Mickey's coming at you with a whole, uh, whole Mickey Mouse organization over here. You know what I'm saying? He's doing his thing. Oh, my God. You bugging. <laughs> We go from Ice Ice Mickey to Minnie Mouse in the house. And and I guess we're just done with the whole Minnie Mouse rapping thing, because we got enough of that on the first one, so now it's just people rapping about Minnie Mouse. Yeah, uh, well, she raps later, doesn't she? Um, I know she does on another song, yeah, but just like the song about her, I think it's just this bargain bin salt and pepper type thing. And the track, there's like the high pitched West Coast whine to it, to the. Wee! I was like, oh, okay. Yeah. They're, they're trying to take this shit seriously, huh? It had a super jazzy intro, too. Like, they felt like this one was the one where they felt like they really put their fucking. Right. You know, we might be able to in. do something with this, yeah. We might be able to get this on more radio play than, than just fucking Radio Disney. Which, by the way, RC. I know, I know, we, we, I know, we've probably talked about this before, um, but for whatever reason, I listened a lot to Radio Disney back when, back when the kid when I was a young uh, when I was younger, and it's not on this because the song comes out in another like five years or whatever. But Lou Bega, yeah, you remember Lou Bega, right? I, I, I remember. He this. recorded, he recorded the, the Disney Mambo Number no. Five, and in it, he just like talks about the Disney characters. But the, the one line that always is stuck in my head since then is when it goes, Huey, Dewey, Louie, can't go wrong. <laughs> <laughs> so that's just burnt into my brain forever, for better or worse. But then there's a fuck, but then they get a song of their own later in the album, oh which God. is fucking weird. Yeah, it's the worst I don't know one. if it's the best song on the album or not, no, but. No, it's the worst fucking one. <laughs> <laughs> it's the worst one? Oh, yes, no. Because, look, at least the Minnie Mouse in the house sounds like, hey, this is a dedicated, you know, salt and pepper parody, which they do two of, by the way. I, I guess that was, like, the safest choice they could yeah. go with. Um, but, yeah, so they, they do this one. Oddly enough, there is an episode in House of Mouse where they play this song, and it's apparently the muses from Hercules d- singing it. Which is like, uh, Whoa. All right, I guess that's the most black female representation you could get from the 90s Disney's uh, material, you know? It is funny, by the way, um, that this song sounds so much like What a Man, and then later they do What a Mouse, so it's like well, we're just getting the same song think, twice th- with just a song in between. Well, I think th- this one is Shoop. You make me want to shoot, babe. Which shoot? Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, you're which right. Which does kind of sound like <laughs> what I mean. A little bit, you know. That is. You know, that now era. that you mention it, hmm. It's that era, you know. Uh, but then we get whoop. There it oh. went. Oh my god! Which Featuring wasn't that a joke? Team, because <laughs> you know they wasn't were that a that joke track. they made. About the song itself, because they were a one-hit wonder, was like, oh, whoop, there it went. Yeah. And now here's a song just called that. I mean, look, they, those motherfuckers were <laughs> cashing the fuck in. <laughs> That's what that They would was. be fools. They were the Lou Bega of their time, you right, could say. Right, right. 
Um, We're not getting another hit. This is it. This is the most we could possibly hope for. But, but, just the way they do it in the verses, because, like, what does he say? Uh, there was something where uh, actual tag team is rapping, because you can tell us their voice, you know? And then he said, so, someone did a dip, but then they slipped. Oops, there they went, hit ground. Oops, there they went, hit ground. And it's like, <laughs> it sounds a little awkward when he says it. But then when they have, like, the characters saying the line where it's like, Mickey says, he's doing a dip, but Daisy slipped. Oops, there she went. And then Goofy goes, hit ground. Like, it's just so much more awkward. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, by the way, this whole song is just about the Disney characters getting hurt and falling down. Because this is the line where he goes, tossing up Donald in the air, he hits the ground. Like... Why are you doing that? Why are you throwing I, I, this duck around well, wait, I think so carelessly the first couple of that lines, he's then just crashing back down to earth? I, I, I think uh, the first couple of lines are, are, do kind of hint to being like, oh, it's Donald's birthday and we're throwing him a jam or something like that. Oh, we're, th- we're fucking throwing Donald a block party. Yeah, and, and what's so funny is, like, they get to the hoop, shaka-laka, shaka-laka, and, like, the characters are doing it, you know? And then Do- oh. Donald does it, and he, like, so immediately gives up. He's like, shaka-laka's not that hard, Donald, but he's like, well, shaka-laka, shaka And then he gets off beat, and I swear to God, it sounds like he's saying, oh, this is some bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> but I think it, it sounds like a combo, but I think he's just like, oh, this is so dumb. I can't even try to do it. Which is very funny <laughs> for him to say. <laughs> it would be very funny if he did say this is a bullshit on the song where Mickey numerous times uh, lets you know that this is squeaky clean music. Yeah. <laughs> over and over he says it. Um, and then I think they also call him M- Mickey the Mouse Supreme. Oh, yeah, MC, M-I-C-K-Y. Instead of the Brain Supreme. Yeah. Oh, instead of uh, B- B- B-O-O-T-Y, oh my, it's M-I-C-K-E-Y, oh my. <laughs> it doesn't work. It doesn't work. By the way, I will take every uh, opportunity to remind you, Mickey says squeaky clean music on a song where the original one, it's got a fuck in it. Oh my Let's goodness. not forget that Whoop There It Is has a fuck in it. That fucking, I just love, because they, they change certain lyrics, you know, and I was just having that moment where I was like, oh yeah, isn't there, isn't there a moment where like, ha ha, uh oh, I'm crazy skin, gotta quit, grab Minnie just to dip it in, <laughs> like, you know. <laughs> they should have left that in, and the fuck. Yeah. They should have left both of those in, just for us to get. Oh my goodness. But yeah. Then where the fuck do we go from there? Oh, uh, what a mouse. Uh, yeah. Um, this one is the one. Yeah, this is the one where Minnie raps. Yeah. Yeah, she raps more. And like, it's not the worst, but it's just so nothing in terms of like, all they had was what a man, but we're literally just making it what a mouse. And. Like, it would be nice if there were, like, some jokes or something, but it's just kind of, like, ch- taking the original lyrics and just making it about mouse and cheese, you know? Like, and, oh. <laughs> yeah, it's all about how much Mi- it's all about how much Minnie loves Mickey Mouse, and at one point even says, um, I'm gonna give props. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> she's even gonna give props. Oh, you know, it, it, now here's the thing, it's like, it is fun to just hear them rapping this, <laughs> like, just like, wow, that they is actually true, yeah. got the actual vocalist to rap and say these things. Like, <laughs> that's the pure novelty of it. It is actually them doing it. And, you know, had they have been even, you know, crazier with it, there might have been music videos for this, you know? So, you know, the original yeah. the original lyric is where she goes, uh, I finally found a, f- uh, I finally found a guy who can make me laugh. And she's, you know, does a little titter, you know, like, <laughs> you so crazy. I think I want to have your oh, baby. Yeah. <laughs> like, oh, that's right. Yeah. This, Love that. But in this version, she goes like, I finally found a mouse that can make me laugh. <laughs> and then she goes like, I get a kick. He's my Mickey. And I was like, oh, no. <laughs> and we're, we're going oh. sub kids bop levels of awful lyric right? writing <laughs> yeah didn't even fucking try with that one i get a oh, kick no. he's my mickey I'm like oh <laughs> i can hear her looking over the guys like should we do another take or <laughs> <laughs> she, she, she's, he has a kick, he's my mickey what what 
<laughs> Hit the chorus again. We just copy and paste in that shit. Don't worry about it. Um, then bow, wow, wow to the beat. Of course, Oof. we had to have this one with Whoopi Goldberg. <laughs> Did we? Did we have to have this one? Oh, we one? had to have the bow, wow, wow. Okay. Yippee, oh, you be a good Snoop Dogg's a thing, you know. But why Whoopi Goldberg? I don't know. I think she just, you know. Why? We, we, we've got tag team. Then we've got these no-name, like, non-credited musicians kind of doing salt and pepper impressions. Mm-hmm. And then randomly we just get Whoopi Goldberg? She's uh, got a cool voice. Didn't she do, like, slam poetry at one point or something? I don't know. She probably could have made this work if the lyrics weren't. Yeah, dog this. shit. This. <laughs> With a, I mean, literally, okay. With a look, wow, 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 this song wag it is up, so wag fucking it down. weird. <laughs> wag it down. So at one point, like I guess she's supposed to be st- she's supposed to be talking about Pluto. This is the song about Pluto. Yeah, that's by right. The way. That's right. Um, not, and again, I, I know though. it's an old he's, hack. Shut bit. up! He's totally different. <laughs> I was gonna say it is a hack joke at this point, but like. Goofy's a dog too, uh, yeah. but we're just gonna ignore the fact that he's a dog because Pluto's a dog. Dog. Goofy's like an anthropomorphic dog. Goofy. He is totally different. You're right. Goofy's evolved um, enough. You know, he he has speech. He's still a doofus, but you know, he's still he at least has speech. So now he's uh, able to count as human. You know. You know, it's funny. It's like when people uh, people who argue against evolution are like, hey. You know, if if, if we evolved from monkeys, well, why are there still monkeys? Mm. This is your proof, yeah, right here, because Pluto's still there. Just because Goofy evolved, you know, yeah. doesn't mean I we mean, just got if rid we of came all from our parents. How come our parents aren't dead, huh? You know, you know, you can poke holes in their logical day, yeah. RC, but they ain't listening. They ain't gonna listen to that. They, they ain't ready to hear that. Yeah. Instead, they're over here listening to Whoopi Goldberg making dog noises, barking as Pluto, and then telling herself to stop it. You can't tell me that that's, that yeah. that's not Whoopi making the dog noises. Yeah, and and w- w- now there was one slightly funny part where she says like, oh yeah, scratch them fleas or something like that. And then you hear like a little, what sounds like a really little picking guitar, like frick, frick, frick. I was like, all right, all right, that kind of got me a little bit. That does sound like flicking fleas. I did like that. <laughs> I did like that. Now, what I didn't care for was how the song ended. Where it oh implies that Pluto, yeah. the cartoon dog, <laughs> rolled in shit and then rubbed it off on Whoopi Goldberg's leg. Oh, I was thinking he, he peed on her leg or something like that. Because he said, what did you put on the side of my pant leg? Well, that is true. Yeah, he could have peed. But also, I think it was, she, she's like, where have you been? They're like, he smells bad. So I guess he rolled in shit also. Oh, and there was one, I, at least I thought this was like slightly funny. Where he's like, dog, he's got a brand new bag and a scooper too. I was like, all right, all right that's something. <laughs> that, yeah, they were trying, but, you know. But then when, when she's like, stop biting me and let me sing this song. I'm like, what the fuck, Pluto? Why are you biting people? <laughs> Yes, this one is that a thing? Since when does Pluto bite people? Jesus. <laughs> Pluto, you bite, want to think about him that way. On her leg, Pluto. Wait a minute. Are we gonna have to have a talk? Are you? Are you a? Uh, you know, still have some evolving to do when it comes to race relations, Pluto. <laughs> oh no. You know, I wasn't gonna say nothing, RC, but I think you did touch on something. Well, what's going on with that? I think there's a very real problem Biden, that needs to be you know, addressed. Biting her, peeing on her leg. Well, what's going on? I, I didn't hear about this with Goofy, you know, or anyone else getting that treatment. Look, we all know Walt had his issues. It's Pluto, the nigga hating dog. <laughs> So, um, <laughs> speaking of Goofy, oh yes, that's right. We we get DJ Goof uh, on on the next one, and this is this is bad. This is I I, I really dislike <laughs> DJ Goof. This is one of those where it's like um, it almost it almost wraps back around to me, like oh, because as it starts, it's just like oh, I can feel myself falling onto my hands already. Oh no, DJ Goof. Oh, now where'd that back box of records go? Wow. Oh, where, what's that loose wire doing here? Runs. You know, it's like oh my god, <laughs> and the, the fucking squirt rubber bro, and then the guy going break. <laughs> Oh, so oh yeah. And then what was that part? No, but it almost like it saved it for me with this part where the guy's rapping and is like, well, I think the fact that he's on the track is not exactly the best idea, but yeah. <laughs> like, I, there was something about the self awareness yeah, in that moment that like cracked me up. I, I did like the the rapping about 
how yes. shitty of a DJ Goofy yeah, that, is. Like, that why he wasn't are we doing this? Rapping. Yes, it was someone else doing it. <laughs> but like the whole premise is like, hey, D- Goofy's a DJ. Check him out. And then it's like, hey, maybe this was actually a bad idea. <laughs> well, whose idea was it? I don't because Goofy the whole time is like, I don't want to yes. DJ. This is a mistake. <laughs> Who put him up to this? Yes. He clearly is inequipped. He's nervous. He's anxious. He doesn't want to do this. Who pranked Goofy to be like, hey, man, we need a <laughs> DJ and you're, you're perfect for it. And he's like, what? <laughs> okay. Knock shit over immediately. What was DJ stand for again? <laughs> I just love how... Yeah, he doesn't like, fucking know. Yeah, the song I, it, in and of itself is a joke on the idea of him being a DJ, which is like, oh, man, you're so 90s. <laughs> Now, here's here's my biggest complaint. It is an absolute crime that the song is fading out, R.C. Mm-hmm. It's to the point where you could barely even hear it anymore. It's so quiet that it is at this point of the song where Goofy slips on something, yes. falls, and does the Goofy holler. Yeah. But you don't. Why would you not make that louder? That's his big thing. Right. <laughs> why wouldn't I hear the goofy holler? Oh, why is it so quiet? Oh, I will say, I will give props on the whoop. There it went when they do the hey, hey, hey. like goofy actually goes hey, 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 that little like jiggling in his voice that he does. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Um. Oh my God! But on this song, now give me a beat. Someone says it. He goes like, "Wouldn't you rather have an apple?" <laughs> And then you hear, hit it, and then just someone hitting Goofy, like, ow! <laughs> yeah, someone just, just punches. Why are they abusing Goofy? Leave him alone! And then he goes, They're just beating him up! I don't know, just what point he just says, Hey, look, everyone, I'm rapping! <laughs> like, <laughs> while he's not rapping. <laughs> <laughs> Why would I need to see him do it? At the end, and then he's like, I'm just listening. Step back and I trip myself. I'm like, which, that's not a hip hop thing, that's a James Brown thing. <laughs> Oh, that's right. Yeah, jump back, trip myself. Oh, <laughs> yeah. But then we get the worst one: the ducks in the hood. <laughs> this no. shit's not even trying. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> I disagree. <laughs> oh, oh! Please drop the gems on us. <laughs> <laughs> no, RZ, look. This for me is the one where it wraps back around. <laughs> Because because it's you and Dewey and Louie in a song called Ducks in the Hood. Oh my god. It, it's a terrible idea. Because it's ducks executed in the head really are always badly. Because I'm talking to the trash wheel, put in your car, or however the fuck his voice goes. I, I don't know any of the lyrics. The only parts I remember are at the very end, where, again, more self, you know... Self-aware. Self-referential meta shit, where one of them goes... How come we're fading? Like when the song's ending? Yeah, yeah. And another duck goes, I'm not done yet. And then another one just goes, I am. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, me too. <laughs> like, that's the listener. Like, I'm very much done with this. <laughs> but just these run. Like, here's the thing. If you're going to do this, like, all right, at least, like, make it flow well or at least have some funny punch lines. But this, there's nothing. Right. But first of all, the thing that pissed me off is that, like, I don't like, and I don't think any kid ever liked the young versions of these kids, okay? Like, for me, Quack Pack was the shit. I never wanted to watch the DuckTales as much as I wanted to watch Quack Pack because when they're the teenagers <laughs> and they've got cooler sounding voices and you want to be like them, you know what I mean? When you're a kid, you want to be a teenager and when you're a teenager, you don't want to watch stuff about kids. You know, you want to watch stuff about being a teenager. That's why it's better to do that. That's why it always pissed me off when I watch a Goofy movie. I'm like, oh, I love it. I want to watch the TV show that's about him. Oh no, it's when he's like fucking eight years old. I don't care about that, <laughs> you know? So, yeah. with this, I'm like, oh, they're rapping as seven-year-olds? Like, ah, oh, could we at least have gotten them as teenagers? You know what I mean? But I think Quack Pack maybe came out, like, three years later. But it still pissed me off because I was like, at least I could have gotten that pop. But trying to hear f- fucking five-year-olds try to rap, like, get the shit out of my face. Like, at least, if they could have gone for, like, a crisscross thing, that would have at least been funny. <laughs> you know? Yeah, I I can see that working, yeah. <laughs> uh, well, I don't know. What do ducks do? Uh, flop, uh, flop, swim, swim. The, uh, Scrooge Mac Duck will make you squib, swim, swim. 
Uh huh. And his cast. Oh, swim, okay. swim. Earth, you know. But um. That'll work. Yeah. No better than it is the rest of these fucking rhymes. Oh my god, it's so bad. There's one part where he goes like. But if you could bust a move on us, then you should. But you never would, because we're ducks in the hood. It's like, oh, God, make it stop. <laughs> the vibe I got, which is not necessarily to say it's good or bad. They are fucking posting up in the song, which is weird. Because they are little kids, you know, canonically. But they're acting like they're badasses, which is weird, because it's like, were they ever... You know, presented I mean, like I badasses. Guess, like, I don't know. know. Kids, I didn't watch enough DuckTales to yeah, know. Kids wanting to be cooler than they actually are. You know, maybe that's that's a joke. Because at one point they're like, oh, Donald's going to beat our butts or something like that. You know. Um, and then, Yeah, which is weird. I, I don't want to think about Donald being abusive either. I mean, like that, you know, that puts I mean, a bad picture on. in my head. Look, look at Donald Duck. Look at his temperament. You know. You know. <laughs> That, that is true. You don't want to think about it, but, right. you know. It's the stuff they show us. We're all whistling Disney's past that got graveyard. got to edit that out, you know what I mean, from the... It, look, it was accepted mm-hmm. in the 40s, you know what I mean? I got the bill with the chill. I got the wing with the thing. And then the, the, <laughs> and then the third one goes, I got grape juice all over myself. And then one of them goes, <laughs> I'll wake up, Huey, or something like that. I was just like, I, okay, first of all, the thing that you guys are saying weren't that cool, but... <laughs> <laughs> like, but then him getting great. Was that the gimmick? Was that like one was supposed to be silly? And it's like, oh, it's like they're he's all not, silly. You know, he's he's not as smart as the other ones. You know, or, or he he didn't know that they were recording. He just was just saying that he got grape juice on himself. But like, wake up, you! Like, is he falling asleep drinking grape juice? <laughs> like, what's happening? That's why I spilt it. Yeah, but the the vibe I got. You remember in the nineties where you couldn't go anywhere with it without seeing fucking. The tall tees with uh, a Bugs, Bugs Bunny, and, Tweety Bird, yeah, and Taz, Taz uh, with like the back with the backwards hat and the big baggy pants. Mm. That's the vibe I got listening to this. Oh, they were trying to get they were trying to get that market, you know. And those I definitely remember seeing a, a Donald Duck or a Mickey Mouse or two with that on. Yeah, you know. Uh, uh, what was it? <laughs> Minnie is fly. Yeah, oh yeah, Minnie is fly. And, uh, whatever the hell phrase from the Salt and Pepper song, I'll take your mouse or whatever. <laughs> but she's a fucking she's a mouse. <laughs> no. but there's that one point where you hear like some guys, you know, a news reporter. It's like this just rep- this just in uh, a bunch of kids led by a couple of ducks have taken on the Sleeping Beauty's castle. And I'm like, what? What the fuck? Why are they going to Sleeping Beauty's castle? What the hell's going on? <laughs> What, what? What's going on, Huey, Dewey, Louie? Why are you going to the sleeping woman's castle? That is strange. I don't want to think about <laughs> it. <laughs> um, but then you get MC Mickey, which is like, okay, this one isn't horrible, but it's still not, like, worth its salt of existing, you know? Like, musically, it's fine. Like, they're going for a bit more of a jazzy thing going on in there, but it's still, like, not worth it. You know what I mean? Like... Yeah, I don't have any notes on that one. Honestly, after Ducks in the Hood, uh, my heart wasn't in it as much. Um, yeah. It, it, it might have taken me down a peg, but I did perk back up for uh, You Can't Botch Jesus This, which Christ. is such a weird what in the parody. World? This is a weird take well, on it. Look, maybe this was just a one you had to throw up your hands and not do, because the only one who d- could have done this well was Weird Al with I Can't Watch This. Like, that's the only way you could have done that. You know what I mean? I can't watch this. Like, talking about, like, TV, that's really bad. Like, Weird Al beat you to that one and did it better. But this was like... You can't botch this. Like, oh, you can't mess this up, but you did. Like, that's such a convoluted way to get to the joke there, you know? <laughs> and then, like... Yeah, I didn't, um... Uh, also, the, the the one takeaway I got from this... And I didn't like this visual at all, by the way, folks. The, this was disturbing to me. That Goofy gets pranked. To not have his pants on, okay? Well, he... he so he's outside of his house. Yeah, the wind blows right? or something like that, and it closes the door. Yeah, and his pants get stuck in the door or whatever. So now he he's he, he's indecently exposed, Goofy <laughs> is, right? And, and then a school bus full of children <laughs> drive by. And they're all laughing at Goofy. I don't... Goofy has to register now. <laughs> like, Go- Goofy's on a list but, now. But, 
That that's not good. Well, the funny thing is, is just how awkward it was phrased, which just makes it like lays yeah. bare how weird it is. Because like, I went outside of my underwear, uh, the wind blew, the door closed, and I was stuck out there. Along came a bus full of kids. You know what they said? You can't watch this. Like what? They said. <laughs> you know what? They didn't say that. The kids, <laughs> you can't watch this, Goofy. Like what? That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> like, what? You did not hear those kids. Yeah. You didn't hear them right. Like, no, it, actually, I was saying, like, wow, it should have been. You can't watch this. Actually, they should have just bit the bullet and just Yeah, you shouldn't out. watch this. Like, oh, the teacher said, oh, kids, you can't watch this. Yeah, okay. <laughs> or, like, that's good. You know, Goofy's about to get a toolbox full of screws and sharp objects to, that are about to fall down his throat. Ah, oh, kids, you can't watch this. <laughs> <laughs> can't watch this is, is a bad premise. Yes. I, I don't like it. It's very flawed. And then at the end, um, he's bad like, approach. he's like, Pluto, Mini, somebody help. But the whole time you hear Pluto is barking. So it's like, he's just barking at him from the inside. Like, <laughs> and then I think a guitar plays. And what, like, it's like, it just starts playing. It's like, that's not part of the original song. Or, All right. I guess to make it sound chaotic or something. Uh. Oh, sure. Yeah. C- c- because he botched it, you see. Yeah. Uh, then we get the most mm. irrelevant one of all. Little Red Rapping what Hood? Was... What the fuck was this? I don't know. <laughs> Why did this need to be here? It just sounded like a slightly less mini sounding voice. So like just doing a little girl doing Little Red Rapping Hood, but she talks too much. She's like, oh, uh, 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 big bad wolf. It looks like you've got some gum in your teeth. And I had gum once and it got stuck in my hair when I fell asleep. And I was just like, I don't. Uh, why is this here? I don't care. <laughs> But she's not rapping. She's yeah, just she, yapping. That's different. It, it should have been called, yeah, Yapping Hood. Yapping Hood. <laughs> little, little red Yapping Hood. Yeah, that doesn't that doesn't uh, come off the tongue as, as good, I guess. Yeah. Then we get the Mickey Mouse Club Mix featuring Mary Mary. And, you know, I, I was kind of like, all right, CNC Music Factory rap. That, that That's about where they need to stay. Sure. <laughs> Yeah. Stay stay in this lane. I can imagine this music, you know, playing in the bumpers around the House of Mouse. You know what I'm saying? Like, we'll be right back to the House of Mouse. You know, Mickey Mouse Club and seeing the people in the bright suits dancing. You know what I mean? There were some weirdly smooth guitars at one point <laughs> that I wasn't expecting. Mm-hmm. But then we get the final track, The Color of Music by Color Me Bad. <laughs> It was like, oh, this is Oof. right around this month, huh? When they were when they was popping, nineteen ninety three, April fourth, yeah. you know. <laughs> <laughs> yep, very specific. And you know, like it wasn't too bad. Like it was like, oh, we couldn't get boys to men, and and we couldn't get a, you know, it, it's so good to say goodbye to this dumb album. But you know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But it was just, it just felt like such an awkward button to be like, that's right, folks. And then we learned something about, you know, mixing genres and how music is from different <laughs> shades can all be respected. I'm just like, ah, okay, but after this, <laughs> you know, <laughs> like it doesn't sound too bad. It's just Yeah, awkward. I don't think we needed this at all. <laughs> yeah. I, again, I'll say it. I said it on the last album. I'll say it here. Uh, you could have ended it with the last song. We didn't need um, the color of music at all. Yeah. Um, just went one step too far, I think. Mm. Um, especially on a club mix, that's a good way to go right, out. Right? Yeah. You don't need the, what like the magic world of Disney, right. whatever ass song. We don't need this at the end here. Music. You don't yeah. need it. The, 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 this is not the album we were making. You right? Know? Yeah. Exactly. We were making, like the rap album. Now we're just going to end with this, like... Respectable, Tender-hearted... Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no. That just doesn't fit. Um, I got a one and a half. How about you? I got a, a generous two. <laughs> oh, wow. 